75 to about 110 or so. Yeah. Oh, I eat an up tilt? I guess I get a new stock. Yeah. Up tilt back air, super good confirm <laughs> this game. One of the best. I have such a hard time pulling off online, though. Like, I, I yeah. just have to get the timing down to be able to jump. Online's just terrible, dude. I don't know. You, you, get, you got a thin it's window to read where they're trying to DI, and, and you got to jump there and get to the right spot. It's just... Yeah. If, if you have access to tournaments, don't play online. <laughs> just 97% of the games I've played, this game has been online. Yeah. I mean, that's most people, but I'm still going to complain about it. You're not, you're not wrong. Online, the netcode's really bad. For this after game. after playing today, this local online's gonna hurt. I can already tell. All right, but the Larry Inkling, uh, never this before is... seen to my knowledge. Yeah. And a purple Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> I've only ever seen him play a Spacey in this game, so yeah, it's a little a... out of context to see this Inkling. Does he? Did he pick the wrong carry? He seems <laughs> to be locked in with it, though. I don't know. Inkling does have a pretty high jump. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> maybe maybe that's all he needs. I mean, a lot of the fundamentals are similar. Back air, up air. Yeah. Use use the big hitboxes. But uh, Sonic, homing attack monster in this game. It is so much better than it used to be. He, I can understand why people are very frustrated to play against him. Yeah. Uh, but uh, got to go fast. Yeah, I'll take the homing attack over the old spin dash only meta. But you're not wrong. 95%. So far, Larry Larry, he's making the inkling work. Street Shark is trying to stay on top of him, keep the pressure going, but some of these aerial attacks. Yeah, and I don't know the window for up throw up air on Sonic, but I would imagine that about now would be the time. And with all the spin dashes that Sonic does, I could imagine the roller would just beat it outright. Uh, I cannot verify one way or the other, but... I think they're about the verifies, but, but a Sonic free knuckle Ding. sandwich for Larry to learn. That's going to be his first stock. Ha! <laughs> See how big his fist gets, dude? Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> Looks like it hurts. It's got so much range. All right, 32 pummels into forward throw, attacking on that damage. It's like... Uh, and Queen doesn't really have the best throws for ledge. Like... Her back throw is good, her up throw is good, her down throw is good. None of them are particularly good when you're just by the ledge. Yeah, I mean, when you're high percentages, I, I'd feel more comfortable giving a potential throw as far as worried about what options you want to cover. Yeah. It's going to keep you alive a bit longer. Plenty of rage, or was there? Down smash is a thing. Down smash, very large hitbox. <laughs> Puts the paint on you. All of Lincoln smash attacks, good in their own way. Sonic is such an interesting mind game because on top of his speed, you have so many different ways to approach with the spin dash and you're going for the homing attack. It just, it kind of inspires you to be on the defensive in general. And I feel like the moment you start playing into that, that's when Sonic really starts to get his his uh, momentum going. Yeah, approaching against Sonic is really hard. Even now with like his nerf, uh, his nerf spin dash options, it's really hard to like find a way in where you're not getting counter hit. That's what Sonic really wants you to do, is to come in to where he's standing, maybe take a step back and do something, and just do that over and over again. Short of the Sonic player taking their hands off the controller, like every engagement is at Sonic's choice and discretion. Fishing for these forward smashes, Larry's like, uh, fool me once, man. I'm not, I'm not rolling that again. Yeah, and that, that homing attack honestly put him in a terrible position. Didn't latch onto Larry, so he just went down and away. And then putting him on ledge. It's, it's rough sometimes. Goes for the jab there. Potential up smash opportunity. Nice arrow to... Like, look, stop spinning, man. All right, and 150. He's not going to get hit by any confirms, but raw moves are going to start killing him now. So he has to be worried about just forward airs, back airs, anything off the ledge. Larry, Larry, Larry he's more than comfortable taking that trade. Since Street Shark down to final stock. Forward smash, that gets shielded, looking for dash attacks. I wonder if uh, if Larry wins this, if he's going to stay in quick. Because this is uh, really not that not that strong of a lead for him. And I don't know if he just wants to keep rolling with it, just trying new stuff. But I... he's looking good now. Now he's got this bigger lead established. Maybe he just needs some time. I mean, he's managed to slow Street Shark down. Like it, Sonic is much more tentative going into the back part of this game. 
I'm not sure what a space he would really bring to the table in his matchup over, you know, if he goes Falco, like maybe Reflector, but that feels risky. Forward smash. Street Shark might need a new controller after that button mash. Down in the last stock. All right, and this is a pivotal percent. All right, misses the, the full jump height that he could get. I think that might have been a true confirm at that point. Runs right, up, gets the grab, the yeah, down not throw. Yeah, the up throw now, so likely not a confirm. Homing attack, man. Just peppers you, hit yeah. and run. Yeah, homing attack is a lot more tricky to deal with in this game because they can charge it way longer. And oh. it's also pretty good at following you, for the most part. Street Shark went for the gusto there. If that down air hit, that would have been a twitch clip. Yeah. And we're pretty low on time, but not enough to instigate a timeout. So Larry's just going to let him sit and make him approach. I feel like this is exactly what Larry needs to do. It's like, yeah. if, I, if I chase you around, he's going to eat me alive at homing attacks, and I can just wait for the right time to hit an up smash and talk about game number two, apparently. And that's what you got to do against Sonic, because once you start playing that I'm going to approach game, <laughs> that's when they start bringing it back. Mm -hmm. Once you get comfortable with your lead, that's that's how Sonic gets to you. Based off of that, if if Larry's, if the idea here is like, you know, let me get some experience on Inkling, I don't see a reason to change. Um, especially that last stock was the most convincing part of the game to me, where it just seemed like, he kind of warmed up to that matchup, and Street Shark just couldn't get away with what he was trying to pull off earlier. Like, he got a raw forward smash on Larry's first stock. Mm -hmm. Didn't pan out going into the back half of the game. So, I imagine he'll stay on Inkling. Yeah. I'm interested to see, like, if this is going to turn into something uh, something more, something greater in the long run for Larry. If this is, like, something he's actually going to try, like later on against like higher ranked players if like yeah. he's gonna try to try to play inkling in this game it'd be interesting to see there's not as many inkling players as we initially expected when this game came out yeah especially in the socal region yeah we have exax and that's about it and that's about it right. i'm also wondering if some of the recent tournaments is inspiring looking at different characters like the first set he had with falco against rido's duck hunt painful to watch like that was rough so maybe he just feels like there are some tools outside of the spaces that he can get away like would help him out in some of these matchups so why not try to work that out now yeah. or maybe he's just having some fun <laughs> nothing Smile. wrong with that <laughs> <laughs> sorry having a good time just, just covering all my bases here <laughs> i mean only he knows but things are looking good even on this counter pick Sonic's down throw when you tech it. It just you're just so close to him, and sometimes it can it can be te uh, scary to tech that in place because you can just get hit by whatever. But Up then if you tech it away, then they're gonna run towards you. It's, it's a whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, could have been worse. That spot dodge put a the if Sonic does miss that homing attack, you have a wide window to be able to punish. Yeah, when there's no target, it sends him at this garbagey angle Ooh. for him usually, and then he's in lag, uh, and then he's just a big stupid ball <laughs> out there doing doing jack. Peppers him up. It's a, a fuchsia Sonic if I've ever seen one. Hundred and ninety-four. My new Sonic OC. <laughs> <laughs> Quick to deviant art. I like the forward set on Sonic. Yeah, it's two hits. It's, it doesn't seem like it would be. He's got like an ankle hit and then a foot hit or something. But it's it's weird to deal with when you get hit by it. It's very it throws you off. It's all in the knees, man. He just kind of yeah. winds up first. Yeah, and then he's just. Once you realize what's happened, he's already all the way back to where he started. So, Street Shark uh, showed a pretty solid flash of offense, but things have started to slow down once again. Yeah. Spin and Dash is just keeping Larry on his toes. Yeah, now that's on Street Shark's choice because now he's got the lead. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. Either way, 
these matchups slow down, regardless of who has the lead uh, when Sonic's on board. And I feel like Inkling's approach in this matchup can be a bit linear. It's like, I wouldn't advise throwing a grenade. Yeah. So you're kind of like fishing for a, a back air, some kind of aerial. And Street Shark is more than comfortable just waiting for the opportunity to just keep chipping away. I do wonder, since Sonic's approaches tend to be more grounded aside from homing attack, how much neutral B might be able Ooh. to actually mitigate Sonic's ability to hit Inkling. Yeah, that's and a hand to forehead moment. He's... Shake yeah, it off, man. Yeah, he had the lead, and now it's all gone. That's that's the rough part when you're you're playing against like these higher seeded players. Is if you make one mistake, like it's so impossible to make up for that. If he, if he gets rid of his stock before he goes to like seventy five percent, I think he can kind of you know get away with that. I, don't know. I that that honestly that was his chance but there. <laughs> this is gonna be rough. You you SD against Larry Larry. You're your chances of winning aren't, aren't yeah. super high. Put it that way. Yeah. Say, Larry, a much stronger man than I. I've not seen one roller this entire time. <laughs> <laughs> that was me. The willpower, the reservation. The it's too. Lee it's will be so actively tempting. painting the stage right now. <laughs> hey, it slows down Sonic. It'll make him. You, you know, you're not wrong there. And that's it. Solid up smash. And you know, Street Charge was